can the cheapest RTX in the market run ray tracing? We are about to find out. For this video, I'm using the RTX 2060 Super with an i5-9400F with 16GB of RAM and the game that we're trying is Minecraft. Before we get into it, please subscribe, turn on the notifications to get notified when I upload a video and leave a comment about what do you think about the RTX 2060 Super. Now let's get right into it. So we are here in Minecraft and as you can see it looks pretty good and it's actually running at 60 FPS. As you can see at top left you can see the temperatures of the CPU and the GPU and the FPS that this is running and it runs actually pretty smooth. It's actually better than I was expecting but anyway this is a super flat world so we are gonna try two maps this one and a modern house. So there we are going to really test this graphics card but man look at the lighting it looks beautiful I'ma let you see some gameplay without me talking right now I'll be back with the other house So we are back with the modern house and the FPS are actually dropping a little bit because this is a bigger map and we are in the interior and it looks, look at that man, that's, that's amazing. So basically yes, this, this RTX 2060 Super can run it but you are not going to run it at 80 FPS or 90 or even more than 100 like the RTX 3090 but this GPU is actually pretty pretty good at its price so if you're looking to buy a, a new GPU I would actually recommend this one if you don't have more than $300 I would recommend this one for sure and let's see what's in here oh this is pretty dark actually uh, these are pretty dark let's see oh this is this is a pretty nice living room whoa yeah it looks pretty good FPS are actually at 40s the temperatures are going up and yeah it's it. FPS dropping again but but it's actually pretty good I think 40 FPS for ray tracing is actually great like you are not going to play FPS games with this with, with ray tracing I mean but then it looks pretty good I actually want to test the water. Where is oh here it is. Here it is. Let's let's test how it looks underwater. Yeah, it looks look, look at the details of the lighting like the water. Looks pretty amazing. Let's see let's see the house from this point of view. Then this is pretty amazing. FPS dropping again, but to the 30 something, I, it, it's pretty stable. So, yeah. So, yeah, the conclusion of the video is basically you can play with it. Uh, you can play ray tracing with the RTX 2060 Super, but if you want to play at 4K or 1440p, I don't think you should be able to. So, if you want to play at better resolutions than 1080p, then yeah. You should buy a better graphics card, but if you play at 1080p, then buy this one, I mean, why not, you know, it's cheap, and in the performance is actually pretty good. I actually have to test this graphics card with Fortnite and other games that I'm doing in, in other videos, but today I showed Minecraft, and I actually hope it helps for you, it helps you to, to choose the right graphics card that you want. So yeah, let me know what you think in the comments and let me know what graphics card do you want to buy and why and I'll be reading them and replaying them. So i see you in the next video, thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and also comment what I'm doing good and what I'm doing bad in the channel so I can fix it and yeah, see you next time guys.